when you experience it, you feel so helpless. Two girls using Facebook to taunt and bully their 12-year-old schoolmate until she killed herself. 160,000 kids don't go to school every day because of bullying. They thought, well, he's a good, easy target, and it's okay to hit him. It's like he's in school or popping up on social media websites. Holy shit! Most recent numbers on bullying are staggering. I was really the kid that would like keep his head down and just stay under the radar. I was not very confident in myself. I was pretty much just a punching bag and didn't have much to work with, so. I went through the same thing. Tons of kids go through the same thing. And at first, people wanted to pick on me. I was different. There was something different about me. Girls can be mean sometimes. You know, I've been the reciprocant of some of that stuff when I was younger. You see a lot of kids who just kind of give up. You never want yourself to ever be that victim. Bullies are really the ones who are scared. I started it because I wanted to protect myself, so I found a martial arts school. A lot of kids that I train now in my martial arts school, they started because of bullying. It's not about fighting. They're learning confidence, they're learning how to defend themselves, and at the same time, they're making relationships with people around them. What's gonna happen is, is you're only gonna get better, not only physically, but mentally you're gonna walk around better. They start to turn into a martial arts athlete, and most of the time the bullying problem just somehow goes away. You have confidence. People won't look to bully you in the first place. There's so many turning points in your life and so many decisions, and to me that decision was, you know, earth-changing. If you're confident with yourself, you know, you can, you can achieve anything. You believe it, you can go after it. Where I am today, I can walk confidently knowing that I can defend myself if it comes to it. And it just helps me be more confident in life. I feel like I could do anything. The power to believe in yourself, that's everything. And that that's how you overcome anything in life. Bullying ends here. Bullying ends here. Bullying ends here. Bullying ends here. The hope is, the answer is, all these martial arts schools and instructors and the community in these schools can make a huge impact. And you can make it grassroots style in every single community, in every single city. We can all get together and help end bullying.